I was just in Ludiana and am happy to bring you this report from the Ludiana Christian Medical College. It is one of two leading Christian medical colleges in the country and is ranked in the top 15 of the 400 medical colleges in India. It was started by missionaries over a hundred years ago and is now ably led by those the missionaries trained. The spiritual life of the students, staff, patients, and patient families is in the hands of the two chaplains, two assistant chaplains, two evangelists, and three attendants, a part of the chaplaincy program. They make daily rounds to pray with patients and their families and organize multiple daily worship services and Bible studies for staff and students. In cardiac surgeon Dr. Bedi's office, we met this family. Their five-year-old daughter, who was the same weight as her eight-month-old baby brother, had a heart defect which was stunting her growth and making her chronically ill and weak. A few days after we saw her, she was recovering from successful heart surgery. On this visit, Dr. Ken Mammon, deputy director of the hospital and head of the urology department, took us on a round of the 14 operating theaters and recovery rooms. He introduced us to this man who had received a kidney transplant donated by his wife, who was recovering in another room. The Missouri Conference will once again be supporting the education of 10 nursing students. We want to thank all of the congregations and the individuals for the generous $5,000 offering for nursing scholarships received this year during annual conference. After conference, one of our retired pastors and his wife handed me a check for $6,000 to make up the difference needed to complete the goal of $11,000 for this year's scholarships. Praise God from whom all blessings flow. The Missouri Conference is making an amazing Christian difference in the life of students, staff, and families in North India. Thank you for your support of this ministry.